In this video we are going to discuss what would you do in the case of a crankcase explosion. When the alarm sounds, the engine speed must be reduced to slow and permission obtained to stop the engine. Inform Chief Engineer When an engine has stopped under alarm conditions under no circumstances must any doors or inspection windows be opened. Oil should continue to be circulated and time allowed for the hot spot to cool. The early opening of doors could cause an explosion due to ingress of air. During cooling down period the engine room staff must keep clear of the side of the engine fitted with explosion doors. After a period of at least 20 minutes, stop lube oil pump, cut off fall air and engage turning gear. The access doors should then be opened and personnel must keep clear of possible flames. Under no circumstances should naked lights be used nor should anyone be permitted to smoke. Examination should then take place for any squeezed out bearing metal or loose bearing metal in the crankcase. Heat discolored metal parts or blistering of paintwork must be investigated. The sealing of the crankcase and guide bars should also be observed. If the crankcase is clear, the camshaft drive and main thrust bearing should be inspected for signs of overheating. Should any damage be found, then a permanent repair must be put in hand immediately. After repair, low should be checked for free flow. The engine should then run in as that, 15 minutes, and then check components for signs of overheating then half an hour at half speed, again check, the one hour full speed then check again. Note, varying times have been quoted for the cooling down period and no set rules are available but the longer the time taken, the greater the safety factor. 